Hello everybody, welcome to Meta Technology channel. In this video, you will learn how to create your own exchange like Uniswap Pancake, but based on Solana uh, blockchain, like this one, like SniperSwap.com. This is the live sample of what uh, we will learn now. You can exchange between Solana tokens, can connect wallet and exchange between Solana tokens like that okay the first step open your browser and go to github.com sniper project sniper swan Solana sniper swap Solana we will clone this project here we can find on the readme file we can find here the requirements and installation guide we will follow this step by step until we finish the first, the first thing we need is a VBS. You need a VBS. So we can get a free VBS for two months here by DigitalOcean. You can get $100 credit. Just click this link. Now we are visiting DigitalOcean. You will get $100 free. You can use it during uh, two months. Okay. Just, for, uh, just fill this fields, your name, your email, your password, and click deploy in seconds. Just to follow the other step until, until complete the registration. After you register, click login to open the login page like that. Type here your email and your password and click sign in. This is my dashboard and uh, already i have 100 dollar credits so the first step now uh, is how to create a vbs from the create button click droplets droplets will give you the vbs after that click marketplace Here in the search field, search for Node.js because we need a VPS installed Node.js, yes, choose this one. So we will choose this server, Ubuntu 20.04, installed uh, Node.js 20.18. Maybe uh, you will find it uh, another version, okay? This is the latest version when I'm, looking, uh, when I'm recording this video. So scroll down and choose the host plan. Basic it's okay. You can choose what server, what VBS you want. For example, we will choose this one. Two gigabytes and the two Intel CPUs, okay? After that, scroll down again to choose your data center uh, region, choose anything you want where your VBS located scroll down again and type here your password your root password it is very important your password must be at least eight characters must contain at least one uppercase character and must contain at least one number and cannot end by a number or a special character okay after that scroll down here we can choose the host name you can leave it like that or you can rename it as you like after that click create droplet and click access Our VBS already installed, okay? From here, click and choose Access Console. Access Console, click Launch Droplet Console to open the terminal. Now we already connected by our VBS. The next step is installing our, uh, installing our software our exchange back again to the github okay 
the first thing copy this command here yes this is a firewall we activated the firewall already after that we will allow the port 5000 because our exchange will use the port 5000 we will allow it okay already added we just follow this commands one by one the other one to check the status of the firewall okay copy the other command line finished the next one we will install get just execute these commands one by one only this okay nice the next one we will move to this folder okay after that we will clone our project by get clone command already clone it okay good after that we will move to the application folder by cd okay done just to follow the steps one by one only that very easy very fast like that Finished already. The next one install serve. Okay. We just follow the steps commands. Finished. Okay. Execute the next one. B and two. Okay, done already. Next one. Copy and paste this comma. Execute it. Already done. The next one. Just wait, it takes some time. Be patient a little bit. Already finished. And the last command. Okay, already finished. Now how to open your decentralized app back again to your node okay just copy the address this and into the browser this address column 500 the port and open congratulations already already running now your new application your new decentralized exchange now how to replace this IP address by your domain name very very easy just back again to your droplets and choose add domain just type type here your domain my domain dot com and click add domain already exists okay one domain blah 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 okay add domain 
okay your domain now is working just go to your registrar and change your domain ns to ns1.digitalocean and ns2.digitalocean ns3.digitalocean from your godaddy account now you can use your domain name instead of ip address that is all thanks for watching